up here training with Keith in Canada. Here's the grounds we're working at. Here's a little L-shaped channel pond. There's another pond over there that's got some points. Right there's a mound. Here's a pond. It dips down in. This rolls off down into this pond. A little channel right there for it. A point. Another point right there. Coming out into it with some weeds. Right up there's another small mound. There's a deep, steep bank. Another pond. A point coming way out in. Another point right there. There's water on both sides of that point where that dog is going to swim up in there. That's a point. Here's a mound. Over there's a mound. Over there's a mound. Yeah, this is this is awesome training grounds. Just awesome. And it's the same stuff over there. You get into some of the same stuff. Don't get much better than this for training. Yeah, there's actually two points on this one right here next to each other. Two small points, but they're still points. I guess there's a point on the other side of that one. Little point right there. Yeah, they're awesome training. I walk up here once. There's just a point here. Another point right there comes way out. Yeah. Pretty good training grounds. Everything here screws with you because it's so rolly, hilly. Ravines, dips. There's freaking dips everywhere in this thing. Anything you do here is technical. It can be short, but so damn te technical that it'll challenge any dog. And there's another field up in there. Good. Yeah, pretty cool. And shoot the birds. Any dog gets trained to follow the gun, like you're giving them a The other thing I didn't need to tell you, anytime you leave a gun station, throw a bump on it. It's going to come up and throw it. Yeah, I just didn't think that's going to be a good job. I've seen that. Yeah, I tried to explain it. No, but see what you do is you leave one there. You just throw one before you come in. If you want to. Always have to let you know. That's a good thing to know. I'll take it back. 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 I'll take it back.
to change his line the way he was looking. Just up on the land pass, sort of what I did with uh, Alfie mm -hmm. when he got one, and then back chain and then get that square out of the way. Now it's your turn, Julie. And Joey better get her act together because she's the last dog.
This is Mima take two. Probably two of the best lines mm -hmm. on that initial part without squaring. Which one next, Keith? He's going to repeat you, Terry. Yeah. <laughs> he wasn't pleased with your throw the first time. I did this. What are you talking about? So, Valerie, yeah. so we have to get into a different little bit of what happened oh. the last day. I think we have gone through the woods. You, you know, just you getting your yeah. seat <laughs> muddy doesn't really count. A fair bit of paint because we also have need some makeup. our white yeah. in here. But, yeah. I was looking at it was sort of like the last one before I left. Here. Came out here. Found these pieces of wood there. Here. 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 Yeah, when the stars started coming up, she was going to be too bad. Good girl! See, I don't think... Good girl! You know what, though, too? Come on, Pokey. it up a little more. Lots of praise.
She avoids that dip, don't she? Yeah. But at this age, what do you do?